A student at Texas State University is creating a program he hopes will save lives. This program will offer free, safe rides for anyone at a party who may become too intoxicated to drive home. KXAN's Lauren Landman met up with the creator who says he got his inspiration after hearing stories about fellow students driving home drunk. Party school or not, a college campus is filled with young adults looking to break away from the stress of class. We're all college students, we all drink and we all make mistakes and we do get too drunk. But one student wants to limit those mistakes by creating a hotline for those who don't have a safe ride home. It's totally free, it's non-judgmental. Mason McKee got the idea of the safe ride program after hearing stories of others driving home drunk. If you get behind the wheel, you're not putting your life in danger, you're putting a fellow student, professor, or even a person in St. Marcus with no affiliation with the university in danger. Mason says it's a Bobcats helping Bobcats approach. The program will be run solely by students. For those who may need the program in the future, they say that's exactly what they would want to see. We we'll trust more students more than, you know, cops and administration administrators because students, I feel like, know where you're coming from. To keep everyone safe, Mason says one male student and one female student will respond to each call and all volunteers will go through training. Reporting in San Marcos, Lauren Landman, KXAN News. Mason says if all goes well and he can grow his volunteer base, he would like to see the program up and running in San Marcos by December. As Lauren mentioned, the new program hopes to stop students from getting behind the wheel of a car while drunk. So we wanted to know how many people have been ticketed for driving under the influence on campus. Well, the Texas State Police Department says 22 people have been caught driving drunk this year. Last year, 40 people were caught driving drunk. Of those 22, five were minors. Last year, four minors were caught drinking and driving. And 32 people have been ticketed for public intoxication so far this year on the San Marcos campus. Last year, 64 people were ticketed.